Have you ever wondered how it all began? Where did the universe with its countless galaxies and stars come from? The origin of the universe is a question that has puzzled humanity for ages. It's a question that has sparked countless theories, debates, and scientific endeavors. Some propose that the universe has always existed, while others suggested a divine architect. But in the realm of science, one theory has gained the most traction. This theory known as the Big Bang Theory has become the widely accepted explanation for the universe's origin. It's a theory that attempts to condense billions of years of cosmic history into a comprehensible narrative. It speaks of a universe born from an incredibly dense and hot state, expanding and cooling over time to form the universe as we know it today. So, what exactly is the Big Bang Theory, and how does it explain our universe's beginnings? The Big Bang Theory begins at a time when all matter, energy, space, and even time did not exist. Imagine a state of nothingness, a point so infinitely dense and small, it's almost impossible to grasp. This is what we call a singularity, the initial state of the universe. The singularity is a concept that defies our normal understanding of the world. It's a point where all the laws of physics as we know them cease to apply. Now picture this singularity exploding. Not an explosion like dynamite or a supernova but an explosion of space and time itself. This is the Big Bang. In the blink of an eye the universe expanded faster than the speed of light. This rapid inflation took place in the first few seconds, stretching the singularity into the vast cosmos we see today. The universe was born, and from this cataclysmic event, all matter, energy, space and time came into being. In these first few moments, the foundations for our universe were laid. As the universe cooled and expanded something incredible happened. With the rapid expansion of the universe temperatures began to drop significantly. This cooling environment allowed for the formation of protons and neutrons, the building blocks of atoms. In the first few minutes of the universe's existence, these protons and neutrons started to combine in a process called nucleosynthesis. This was the universe's first fusion reaction, and it resulted in the creation of the simplest and lightest elements, hydrogen and helium. These hydrogen and helium atoms were unstable at first, but as they gathered in the ever-expanding universe, they became the first stable matter. This was a defining moment in the history of our universe. The creation of these basic elements set the stage for the evolution of more complex matter and the formation of stars, galaxies, and eventually, life as we know it. This was the beginning of matter as we understand it today. But how did we get from these simple atoms to the complex universe we see today? Well, gravity, the cosmic glue, played a pivotal role. It caused these free-roaming atoms to coalesce into immense clouds. Picture these clouds, not as fluffy cotton candy in the sky, but as swirling dense masses of atomic particles. Over time, these atomic clouds grew denser, and under their own weight, they began to collapse. The core of the cloud heated up, and when it reached an extreme temperature, a process called nuclear fusion ignited. This was the birth of a star, a blazing beacon in the cosmos. Stars didn't just pop up in isolation though, they were social beings, gathering together in vast groups. These congregations of stars, bound by the same gravitational force that sparked their existence, became the galaxies we know. From atomic particles to stars, and from stars to galaxies, gravity was the master sculptor. This process led to the formation of the universe as we know it today. So let's recap what we've learned about the Big Bang Theory. Our cosmic journey began from a point of singularity, an unimaginably dense and hot state. In an instant this singularity exploded and our universe began its rapid expansion. This event, known as the Big Bang, set the stage for everything that followed. As the universe cooled down, basic elements like hydrogen and helium started to form, creating the building blocks for the rest of the matter we see today. This period of nucleosynthesis was crucial to the existence of everything in the cosmos. Eventually, these elements clumped together under gravity's relentless pull, giving birth to stars and galaxies. These celestial bodies are the architects of the universe as we know it. They've created heavier elements, ignited life and continue to shape our cosmic landscape. And that's the Big Bang Theory, a glimpse into the incredible story of our universe's beginnings. Subscribe to our Universal Universe channel for daily cosmic adventures.